Tyrannosaurus dickheads! They killed Brian! That's right, motherfucker! I'm talking about you! You prehistoric limp dick motherfucker! I'm coming for you! And when I do, I'm gonna murder the shit out of you! And you're gonna be extinct again for the second time! What's up, ghouls and gals? It's me, Ron. I'm just the main man. The co-hostess with the most is Mr. Sid. Motherfucker, you got to go in the building, man. What's going on, guys? Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. Today, we gathered here, ghouls and gals, to talk about Jurassic World Domino's Pizza. Or Dominion, <laughs> Dominion, whatever the fuck okay, it's called. Yeah, yeah. We're here Dominion to talk about the good. Jurassic World movie with the uh, legendary actor Chris Pratt. Uh, <laughs> yes. yeah, and, uh, but Ron before Lord we get himself. into all that, dude, uh, before we get into all that, uh, where did you uh, check out uh, Jurassic World, man? Or when did you check it out? I checked it out like opening weekend, man, Friday night. You know what I'm oh, saying? Yeah? Got there 20 minutes early just to make sure nobody was in my goddamn seat because you know how people do. You know what I'm saying? They're like, oh, the movie, the credits are right. And they try to act stupid like if they can't read on the ticket. They're like, this is your seat? What? This isn't my seat? This is a different number than the one that's on my ticket? What? what? (laughs) Yes, asshole, get up. (laughs) Exactly. So I was in there and there was like a whole row behind me that was uh, empty. And I was like, "Uh uh-oh. And there's like three... Like two or three trailers in, and I'm looking back and I'm like, damn, they still not here. <laughs> all right, because it's like at least seven, eight, nine seats just all back to back. I'm like, oh shit. And then, like, right before the movie starts, like five, probably like two, three minutes before the movie, they came right in, like right on time. Like, as soon as they sat down, it was like one family and some friends, and they came in and sat down, and that shit came on. Like, Jurassic. I was like, like damn. Wow. Brought half the fucking town with them to watch the Jurassic fucking world movie. Yeah, Brought half what? the park with them. And nobody sat in the seat either. I was like, wow. I was like, that's crazy. Opening one. So yeah, so we went down there. Me and the wife went downtown. Saw it opening day Friday night, man. Our theater was packed. What about yours, man? Where'd you, where'd you go? When yeah, did you man. go? We rolled up on, uh, we rolled up yesterday for a $5 mm-hmm. Tuesday because your boy likes a bargain and I'm also cheap as fuck. So we rolled up on five dollar Tuesday to the local <laughs> Cinemark to go check out uh, Jurassic World, uh, and the Thaquatches were out tonight, dude. We're out, yeah, last <laughs> night rather, man. There was a lot of motherfuckers out there, dude. I walked into the theater, man. I mm-hmm. fucking because I'm smart. I got my phone and I got my stuff ahead of time, and I was like, don't have to wait in that line. There was a line out the fucking ass, and like I'm getting my stuff off the rack, right? And all like the fucking mm-hmm. Karens and fucking like little silver teeth kids are like, mom, how come he gets his stuff? He doesn't have to wait in line. I'm like, yeah, because your fucking parents are dumb. They should have yeah. used, and they used the smart. fucking app. Yeah, so I'm fucking going <laughs> to the thing, right? I walk into the theater. It's packed uh-huh. to the fucking gills, dude. It's packed to the gills. It smells like a fucking Chuck E. Cheese up in there. It smells like feet and ass. There's, everybody's packed mm. to put an elbow up in that bitch. And wow. I, while well, I was fucking sitting down in the fucking row and stuff and like it packed, dude, there was not an empty seat in the fucking house and wow. um, trailers are rolling or whatever. Right. And I'm noticing it's kind of a noisy crowd. Right. And I'm kind of like, ah, whatever. It's the trailers. Whatever. It's fine. I'm not going to be that guy. I was like, I'm not going to be that guy. And like, so the trailers are going right. And like uh, the fucking movie starts. And then you hear that like, Rah! fucking dinosaur thing and like people are still kind of talking but then again it's like so fucking loud that like it over encompasses like all the people talking and it's so loud to the point to where like the movie almost tells you like to shut the fuck up and everybody's just like like their fucking attention just gets straight to the movie but the one thing that fucking bothered me was that the people sitting next to me the guy he kept like 
like checking his phone and he kept reading his text messages but like he had like the like it was an older guy he was like an older like heavy metal like cholo guy and he had like his fucking phone uh, dimness like all the way down so i wasn't like trying to be like hey what the fuck dude uh but he was like reading it and i would just notice homeboy was like probably blind as a fucking bat he had the font like each letter took up the entire fucking screen and he was like like if he was looking at fucking ancient text or fucking a scribe or some shit like that and then i noticed that like every time his fucking phone went off he had the stupid annoying thing where like you know in the back where it has like the flash for the camera and when they get a text message or something like that that flashes that lights up. Everybody in the fucking theater had their phone like that. That's what you kept seeing every fucking two seconds. The text so message. The text. It's a text message. And I was like, oh my fucking god! I was like, I'm gonna shove that phone up your fucking ass if you don't stop that <sighs> shit. I hated that. And eventually, like, they stopped because people were like, hey, hey, like everybody was like, hey, hey. like you know, like getting all mad. They're like, I spent five dollars like everybody else like, to be here. <laughs> but yeah, man. So that was my experience in the theater. But after a while, everybody kind of chilled the fuck out and they were kind of like... We did have people talking throughout the movie. We did have... Uh, so fucking obnoxious and annoying. pop off, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's just inevitable, bro. You know what I'm saying? When you're getting that many people in one space, there's always uh-huh. going to be those couple people that are just going to, you know... So fuck fucking annoying, airport. dude. And there's always that old fucker. There's always that old fucker, like, in the fucking theater. And he, he's, like, on the phone, like, what? Huh? I'm in the movie! No, not right now. <laughs> He's like, oh, bye, okay. I'm like, what the <laughs> fuck? This fucking guy. <laughs> like, what the exactly. fuck? Exactly. Oh, God. But enough about assholes yeah. at the movie theater. And the kids. Uh, the kids are crazy. Yeah, the kids are the... Dude, and like, yeah. you know, like, I live in a predominantly Mexican area. I'm Mexican myself. Mexican kids mm. are the fucking worst, dude. They're just running around all hopped up on fucking Coke and hot Cheetos, like, fucking destroying everything and, like, and nobody tells their kids to like shut the fuck up. Like no parent is like it's like shh, they're just like watching Chris Pratt do the thing with the hand, and then I like fucking like you know like ah ah god, ah. <laughs> I would have a fucking heart attack over here. Oh my god! <laughs> but uh, yeah, man. Anyways, <laughs> moving on, moving on to other assholes. Uh, Jurassic <laughs> World, uh, Jurassic World, Domino's Pizza stars mm-hmm. uh, Chris Pratt, and all as. Uh, I think his name's just like Chris Pratt in the movie. I don't even know. I think his name's like Owen, right? Isn't he like Owen? Like yeah, Owen, right? Owen yeah. Sausage? Yeah, that's his name or something like that. And then Bryce Dallas Howard, who plays a hot uh, redhead lady. And then they have uh, <laughs> they have uh, Disney Channel. They have Disney, that Disney Channel girl. She looks like she's from the Disney Channel. Like every time I saw her, I felt like she was going to do the little thing with like the, with, like, the okay, Disney wand. Channel. The wand, right? She was going to be like... <laughs> <laughs> yeah every time i yeah, saw her i was like i thought she was gonna be like hey 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 no <laughs> like sing some little disney song and it starred her and then it also starred uh i guess locust were also the star of the movie as well uh like uh the, the locust were also star of the movie and it also starred uh jeff goldblum it also starred uh mm-hmm. laura dern uh, it also stars sam neil all the, all of the old people are back to fight the dinosaurs. Everybody's back for dinosaurs. Everybody's back. back. Everybody's back. Uh, what did you think of the cast of this movie? Like, who was like your favorite and least favorite person in this movie? Come on, man, Jeff Goldblum. <laughs> Is your least favorite and favorite person? Because that would make sense. That would make sense. Huh? Yeah, he was pretty wild in this movie right here, man. Jeff Goldblum did- looks like he they let him out of like a retirement home, and he was just like wandering <laughs> onto the set of like Jurassic World. And he's just like, mm, yes, dinosaurs. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think I think Jeff Goldblum is becoming uh, too aware of his Jeff Goldbluminess. Like he's yeah, like, that he, might like be the case. yeah, mm-hmm. like he's already too more like like every movie. He just he's just Jeff Goldblum now. Like he's not the character from Jurassic World. He was just Jeff Goldblum. You know what I mean? Like maybe that's what you know. He's just giving people what they want. You know what I'm saying? Like. <laughs> People want the Jeff Goldblum. He's the only one that made me laugh, though. He's the only one that made me laugh. Like, he's the only one that got me like, oh, that's funny. Like, he said a few funny things. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I did like Jeff Goldblum. You know, I just, I did not like Chris Pratt in this movie, man. I'm just over, I'm over his whole fucking character as overall. Like, and, 
you know, what can, what can you do, man? It's not like he can do anything with this character. You know what I'm saying? Just, he's not like a really like, traditionally trainer. good actor either. Like, he's not like, like, I mean, I guess he's likable. I mean, I, I, I don't People know. People like him from, um, you know, Guardians of the Galaxy. He's just like, he, the whole movie, he just does this. Whoa, yeah. whoa. He's like, lock eyes with me. Lock eyes with me. Lock, eye, lock eyes with me. <laughs> he's like, whoa, g- girl. And then, ah. and then, like, he thinks he can communicate with, like, the dinosaurs really well. The dinosaur is always like, ah, get the fuck away. He's like, oh, <laughs> hey, 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 hey. <laughs> He's like, oh. Uh, uh. <laughs> Yeah, the dinosaurs was like, "What? He thinks yeah. he can talk to us?" Yeah, ah, he's like, yeah. and he, and he just runs off. <laughs> Doesn't he know we'll fucking kill him? <laughs> Speaking of the dinosaurs in this movie, dude, where were all the fucking dinosaurs in this movie? Where the were, were they taking a break or something? Were they were they chilling in the fucking cabana and the fucking uh, dome they had there for them? Where the, where... <laughs> they had like, I do, I do remember like they had like a dinosaur highlight reel. <laughs> where they were like getting like they were making dinosaurs in laboratories and stuff and then there was like a black market dinosaur market or some shit and oh then, yeah they went and it was like pokemon fuck? it was like pokemon yeah, was, or some shit yeah and then some like yeah. people were like weird goth people were like look at my bird i had he's right here on me yeah, yeah. like raising it, it, was, it felt very star warsy too there for a second right like it felt like they were like in an underground cantina or some shit yeah, um, it was weird, bro. Dinosaur fights. What the fuck was going yeah. on? They had like this like, whole dinosaur black fights. market thing that they made up and shit because dinosaurs, <laughs> the world evolves, you know what I mean? Black market dinosaurs. Yeah. Speaking um, of uh, the world with dinosaurs, imagine mm-hmm. how fucking annoying it would be to live in a world with fucking dinosaurs. You'd be like, oh, I can't go to work. Why not? I was uh, stomped and killed by a fucking stampede of fucking velociraptors or some shit. Or like a yeah. fucking Tyrannosaurus Rex swallowed my car, so I can't fucking drive to work. The, the Triceratops is blocking the highway, so we can. Yeah, like, like, like me and my girlfriend went out to eat the other day, and a, and a fucking Velociraptor, a fucking a fucking pterodactyl picked her up mid dinner and took her away. Oh. I haven't seen her in weeks. <laughs> yeah. That's a good one. You know what I mean? That's a wild shit right there. Yeah, that, uh, that was a good point that they made, too. Like, they had, like, velociraptors, like, running around in the front yard and shit, like, terrorizing kids and shit. <laughs> yeah, I like you that video I mean? they kept showing. I like that video they kept showing of that poor white woman getting attacked by, like, the dinosaur. She was like, oh, 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 God. <laughs> like, yeah. they just kept rewatching it. They're like, look at this dumbass. <laughs> They're there in the lab, like, fucking watching it over and over again. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that shit was wild, man. There were so many characters in this movie. Yeah, at one point I counted them out, and there was eight people on uh, in one shot at one time. Yeah, they had to like frame. they probably had to film every scene with two fucking cameras because there were so many fucking people in frame. Like it was fucking crazy. It was like jer- like Jesus team Christ. A and team B. Let's all go. I yeah, thought my like, movie theater was packed. This fucking movie was packed. Whoa! This movie was <laughs> fucking packed, bro. <laughs> To the fucking rim with this, to God the rim damn. with this man. This movie was packed in both cast and both fucking plot. There was like eighty-seven fucking different movies going on in one fucking movie. You had the it fucking was. clone, the uh, fucking Twilight fucking clone saga going on with the fucking girl over there. You had fucking uh, Taken starring Liam Neeson and a fucking dinosaur, and then you had mm-hmm. fucking uh, the fucking premarital fucking I Love Lucy show going on with fucking Chris Pratt and his fucking hot redhead chick. And then you had fucking ooh ducktails going on with the fucking chick that they met at the fucking underground Pokemon arena that they were fucking oh, at. Yeah. They had like so many fucking movies going on, and then and that that a fucking Stephen King movie going on with like these fucking biblical fucking locusts that like for some reason were in the movie more than the fucking dinosaurs. They should have just been it called Jurassic Locusts. Locust. Yeah. yeah, yeah, and no, uh, and then uh, yeah, the subplot with the locusts and the uh, scientists. Speaking of that scientist, dude, I have never seen a more like bitched out character than that fucking scientist. They had him. I had they had my boy, the, my boy from fucking Law and Order SVU, Detective <laughs> Wong. They had my boy wearing a fucking Mister Rogers fucking like gay ass like coffee sweater. He was just like, oh, uh, I'm sorry, oh, no. like what the. Fuck? <laughs> We might be able to switch the DNA plan oh, patterns. No. Hey, please please don't slap me. He's like, yeah. please don't hit me, though. I can fix this. I can steal the formula from a dead woman's 
the thing. Her diary has the secrets. I stole it. Also, why did they have a a clone aspect of this movie? Why the fuck did this movie need that? What the fuck? And then they kept being like, oh, yeah, her mom, like her mom. And I'm like, who's her mom? I'm like, what movie does her mom come out in? Did I miss something in the comments? In the comments below, can y'all let me know? Does the this fucking character right here? Does she come out in the other Jurassic World movies, or did did she just fucking randomly pop up? Because I feel like I'm missing a fucking beat here. I feel like I'm missing fucking something. I guess that I think that kid was from like the first Jurassic. Park I know the little girl movie. comes out, but I know I don't know about like I don't know, man. Movies, I don't know, man. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. And then they, uh, auto- they automatically <laughs> assume a lot in this movie that you've already seen everything. You're already speaking of that. A lot, I feel like a lot of stuff was cut out of this movie because there's certain <laughs> times where characters like teleport from one place to the other. Like that, that one young uh, guy, this guy right here on screen, the one guy that was like had a weird. I don't know if he had like a weird like homosexual relationship with like the movie's villain. Remember, he was like, "Do you have one of my uh, protein bars?" <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And he was like, our bond, I would never break that. And he's like touching his like chest and shit. And he's like, what the fuck is going on? Yeah, I got that. Uh, there were certain points where that character like just pops up like out of nowhere. Like if he has like, he's like fucking Nightcrawler or some shit. Like he just like, he's like, I'm out of nowhere. Now. Just appears. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like the, I like the, uh, the pilot chick though. She was dope. Man. Yeah, she was, she was cool. She was fine as hell too. She was fine. Uh, yeah, yeah, she, she was, was fine was as hell, hell man. And yeah, like, I like her character, man. It was cool. She was she was a cool like they had like you know what I mean. It's this is one of those movies where like it had all <laughs> of the ingredients to like be good. It's it's a it has fucking dinosaurs. It has hot chicks doing cool shit. Mm-hmm. It has dinosaurs fighting with each other and shit like that. When you get to fucking see that, when the movie lets you fucking see dinosaurs, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. And speaking mm-hmm. of the dinosaurs, man. uh what the fuck was up with like every single character in this movie since it had like 19 main characters? Every single character, they had like the most massive fucking plot armor ever. Never did I feel that anybody was in any fucking danger. Even when Chris Pratt and, yeah. the, and the fucking chick from DuckTales were running on the fucking uh, ice or whatever, like the ice was breaking and then like they went in and the, that dinosaur that was trying to kill them, some reason mm-hmm. moved out of Chris Pratt's way and like let him get out of the fucking water. <laughs> yeah it was a lot of yeah i mean what you know and that's but here's here's the thing too because when you know when i was um watching this movie um you know i had to remind myself like this is a dinosaur action movie yeah and there was with, no dinosaur with, action with, like but when they did have the action, that was cool though like, like when they it, fought it was cool when they did, yeah, when they did have the fights and stuff, like it was good or whatever. But I was just like, I don't, like, I don't think like the if this like the most thing that like you're gonna be able to have to do is like they're gonna either have to like fight like other dinosaurs like what mm-hmm. they, which they did in this movie, or like bring out the military to like eradicate dinosaurs. I would have rather seen before. that. I would have. I would have rather seen that. that. I don't think that they they want to. They don't want to promote like an animal cruelty. They're already all fucking yeah. dead. Who cares? You know what I mean? They're already all dead. <laughs> they but they're brought back. So now you gotta be humane about it and stuff like that, right? So I'd rather see dinosaur wars and shit or whatever. But yeah, a dino you know war like, would be fucking cool. You, you can't do that. The only thing you can really do is you can't you can you can't do military versus dinosaurs. Like that's not instead. Know. Instead, what we got was like two hours of like fucking Chris Pratt and like trying to like do like this weird little little fucking house on the prairie type fucking like relationship with like his fucking hot redhead wife and his little like adopted like fucking girl. Meanwhile, they were having like a fucking Seinfeld reunion over here with fucking Jeff Goldblum and Sam Neill and Laura Dern. That shit made no sense. The whole like we're co-parenting like yeah, a lot of the stuff that, in that, that shit made no sense. Yeah. A lot of this shit didn't make any sense, man. When the dinosaurs were about to kill them, like you said, like something would happen and they wouldn't die. You know what I'm saying? Like it's just, it's over and over. Or the and dinosaur would you know literally like stop trying to kill them so they could get away. He'd be like, "All right, I'm gonna wait." Okay, okay. now they're okay. finally trapped. Ah! <laughs> now they're finally trapped. Now two dinosaurs are gonna fight over who's gonna eat it first. You know what I'm and saying? Then, like, okay, another okay, thing too. Like there was another part where Bryce Dallas Howard is running away from that dinosaur that has like the big claws and oh, she like goes yes, into like yes. the water or whatever. And the dinosaur like knows that she's there. 
but doesn't do anything to her. He's just like, okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, what? What the fuck? You would have been dead. You would have died. Yeah, these def- these dinosaurs definitely take liberties. You know what I mean? Yeah. And when there's eight main characters. You can't really do that much close action. You know what I'm saying? You can't really do that much close. I feel, I guess, I guess they just played it safe with this one. You know what I'm saying? They should have killed it somebody in this time. movie. Somebody in this movie should have fucking died. Like, nobody yeah. dies in this fucking movie. Yo, I'm trying to remember, like, the body count for this movie, and I'm not really remembering a lot of people. Right now, uh, right really now, when we get into, uh, right now, when we get into spoilers, we'll uh, talk about, like, the body count. I don't want to spoil this movie yet, right now. We're kind of, like, in a general, like, discussion, so I don't want to spoil it just yet. But, uh, yeah, man, this movie was real fucking, like, weird. It had, like, a real, like sci-fi channel like fucking movie plot like the plot of the movie is essentially like the company diocin is uh creating these like man-made locusts that are going to eradicate the food population so that way they can be reliant on diocin and they can only eat diocin crops and that way they'll be the dominant like food chain and (laughs) meanwhile we have a whole clone uh subplot going on that Mm -hmm. connects uh through leaps and bounds of fucking logic through the locust and uh yeah it's just insane all while that's going on we have dinosaurs living in this sanctuary and uh yeah, yeah it's just so much island. going on dude it's so much mm-hmm. going on with the jurassic park movie the first movie like it was so simple they were in a park there was dinosaurs that's it and shit went bad. That's it. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like, there yeah. wasn't like, oh, but this and that and like 50 other subplots going on and blah, 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 blah. Like, they're just doing too much, man. Like, they're doing too much. Yeah. Well, you know, they you know, they tried to go out with a bang and stuff with as much shit as they possibly can, man. And they definitely did that. It just it felt like it was too much. The shit didn't make sense. Um, but it definitely was entertaining. Mm. I'm not going to lie. This shit was entertaining. I was watching this shit. I'm like, yo, I'm going to see some more dinosaurs. Yeah, so that's what out. I kept saying. I was like, let the die. dinosaurs come out. <laughs> I was like, where oh, are the dinosaurs? Yeah. I want more dinosaurs. Yeah, I was like, oh, let yeah. them kill each other. I was like, God damn it. That's another thing. Why are none of the Jurassic Park movies rated R? Why are they all like PG, PG-13? Wouldn't, they, wouldn't it make more sense to make a rated R Jurassic Park movie so that way they could be, like, yeah. ripping motherfuckers apart and shit? Like, dinosaurs would be ripping motherfuckers apart. Yeah, you know, I guess they don't want to go, like, the horror way with that. You know what I'm saying? Because once you go that way with the, with the blood and the guts and shit, that makes it yeah, a whole I mean, different story. When, I mean, uh, sometimes you know. they do, but they do it in a, in a way where they're, like, they'll show, like, the dinosaurs eating somebody but it'll be like off camera yeah, and then you'll like yeah. see blood like on a leaf or some shit like you know swallow I mean? like, them whole take an, you know, take yeah that, bites, they did show that they did show that like that's it like you know like yeah do it's much. a done deal <laughs> yeah that's mm-hmm. true they did show so. that speaking of again of the dinosaurs what did you think of uh blue that's you my boy blue blue and blue blue and her baby beta man that subplot that shit right there fucked me up i was like what i was like so you know you know what I'm saying like the dinosaur like hangs out around your house or whatever and then like you know that there's poachers and stuff and then you dig and then your child essentially gets kidnapped your dinosaur gets yeah. kidnapped now you have to make a pack to go get the ba- like this your- is both your, you surrogate, your birth, both your surrogate children get kidnapped. Your your pet dinosaur and your your actual child get kidnapped by like the most generic like TV villain of all fucking time. He's like, yes, I kidnapped dinosaur. I got dinosaur for you. Yes, okay, space now. Blue, blue is like, <laughs> go get my fucking uh, son right now or daughter, whatever it was. I feel and like blue just, like, has uh... the forest the whole movie. Yeah, he's just like. She's, like, she's just chilling right there in the, in the meadow. She's just chilling there in the meadow like that. <laughs> yeah, she's just like, all right, just waiting for Chris Brown to come back with my kids. Yeah. All right. <laughs> okay, I guess we're just going to wait. Yeah. All right, he's back. All right, cool. I'm not going to eat him. Like, why did you take the fucking, why didn't you take Blue with you? You can communicate with it. You could have drugged it. Yeah, come on, Blue. We're getting in the van. We're, get, we're flying on Jet Blue. Come on, Blue. We're on Jet Blue. <laughs> Chill yeah. out. Give him some blue chips. Yeah, <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude! Like that was so fucking corny. That like, yeah, oh, man. Oh, oh, oh. 
Yeah, he's the velociraptor uh, whisperer. You oh, know? God. Jesus Christ. <laughs> he's, the, he's the velociraptor whisperer. Dude, whenever he had an actual conversation with the fucking velociraptor, I almost mm. fucking threw my popcorn at the fucking screen. I was like, what the fuck? What? I was like, is this what? <laughs> He's like, don't worry, girl. I'll get I'll get your daughter back. I'll save the day. You can count on me. And then she was like. He's like, oh, fuck. He's like, oh, fuck. There, let's go. <laughs> He's like, all right, let's go. Fuck it. <laughs> I'm going to go save her. Yeah, there were oh so many God. moments where I just looked at my wife in this movie and I was like, yo, what did you think about the moment that, um, damn, I, I'm, I, I don't remember um, where it was in the movie, but the dinosaurs, <laughs> they fucking jumped the other dinosaur. Like, oh, towards the end, them? yeah. Yeah, the end. Yeah, <laughs> yeah the, the T-Rex, it gets made out like to look like a punk ass bitch. And then the one with the feathers comes out and he, they're like, hey, you want to fuck this guy up? And they're like, and then like a fucking anime theme song started playing. It was like, hey, hey, yeah, yeah, let, let's go. And they were like, bro, <laughs> that shit was crazy as fuck, bro. Was I crazy. was like, what? I even said out loud, fuck? I even said out loud, I was like, that's cool. I was like, that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> I looked at my wife and we gave each other a high five. Uh, yeah. I, 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 yeah. Even, <laughs> even I, I was like, I, I was like, that was cool. I was like, that's dope. I was like, they needed more shit like that. Yeah. I like, I want to see more dinosaurs getting fucking jumped, bro. Let's see what's going on. They were having like a WWE match and shit. I was like, oh. Nah, all you needed was, uh, mm-hmm. all you needed was that fucking guy from the WWE, fucking Jim Ross. He's gonna be like, it's a slobber knocker king. Yeah, oh! exactly. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he's got a chair oh no uh, yeah. he's down <laughs> he's down oh no <laughs> <laughs> exactly <laughs> yeah this shit was crazy man oh, and uh you know you know what though uh all over the place super fast pace whole yeah. lot of bunch of shit going on with here whole big cash too much on. shit cgi fucking you know what i'm saying like and you know uh, what? Uh, Speaking of the CGI, dude, the, why does this movie not look as good as the original Jurassic Park? The original Jurassic Park looks like 80 fucking thousand times better than like this movie. Like they don't look bad. Don't get me wrong. They don't look bad. They don't you look can bad clearly, at all. You can get some, yeah, but some of them look better than other ones. <laughs> like, yeah. you know what I mean? Like they don't look bad because sometimes yeah. I think they are using like real like animatronics. I think some of the times. I think that what well, yeah, I think there was one where I was like, I don't know about this one, how they're doing this, but it doesn't look right, and it's not CGI. So because it, it couldn't have been CGI, it had to be bad animatronics puppetry. Oh, it looked like a doll, movie. like one of them, like the Triceratops ones look like dolls, right? Kind of, some of those look like it dolls. Had, I remember it had, they, I think it had like a like a pink eye or like a red eye or whatever. Yeah, it just kept like moving its head around. I was like, I don't know what the fuck that is, but I don't, it doesn't look right for some reason. You know what I mean? But um, but for being for being what it is, man, I mean, you know, Jurassic Park is a fucking set the standard for CGI bringing oh, yeah. dinosaurs to life for the first time in film accurately. Not ac- well, yeah, technically, yo, know, for the time it was accurately depicted for the time. You know what I mean? But this is like the first time when they put dinosaurs on screen and make it believable. But nowadays. That's not that like nobody cares. Like we've been past that. Like everybody can yeah. put, make dinosaurs. Like the CGI level is so advanced now that that's not enough. You know what I mean? And I feel like they did try to max it out with the story. But at the end of the day, it's a dinosaur adventure film. I you know that. what I mean? Like it's like, yeah, I would like to see more horror elements of it. But yeah, I would like to see fucking more uh, people, you know, body count more uh more um you know more dinosaurs like more of the dinosaurs shit more than yeah. the human shit like i really want to see the dinosaur side the human it. element is way too big in this movie there's way too much yeah. shit going on with the humans mm-hmm. that like as i say it's the same issue that i have with like godzilla movies like i i'm not here to just see the fucking humans bring up godzilla yeah. god damn it that's the same thing that i felt with fucking uh with fucking uh, the Jurassic World movie, I'm like, I don't care about fucking stupid Chris Pratt and his receding hairline. Bring out the fucking dinosaurs, goddammit. I was like, shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So, 
Yeah, man. I I mean, for for being what it is, it, it was yeah. I like initially, I was like, yo, this is so trash. But yeah. But in hindsight, though, I'm just like, oh, oh, speaking of trash, what did you think of the villain of this film? That stupid doctor guy. He was in a whole other fucking movie. That guy, like, he yeah. was like in a Saturday fucking morning cartoon. Like whenever he got like defeated, he was like, no, no, no. <laughs> I was like, yeah, little, yeah, that shit was wild. He was trying to. He was like, no. <laughs> he did one he of those. Like the cliche, the cliche, uh, you know, bitch villain. Like, I'm gonna get out of here alive and escape and all that. That scene was dope though when the uh, dinosaurs got up in this. Oh yeah, fucking, they attacked uh, his ass. Yeah, tunnel to with the fucking flashing lights and shit. That shit was. Dope, yeah, man. that was cool. That was cool. There was some really That's one dope person element. that died. He died for sure. Yeah, he died. there was some dope elements on the movie, man. I definitely enjoyed it. That's what I was saying. Like initially, when I got out of the theater, I was like, "What the fuck is this garbage?" Wow. They went full. I'll <laughs> give them this. They went full like B movie, like full balls to the walls. Like we're gonna be dumb as fuck. <laughs> like we don't. You gotta up. just go with it. We yeah, gotta we sneak up on there. Up. And there's nine of us, and there's a fucking giant dinosaur. You know what? We're all making it over there. We're all going to this way. Yeah, gonna and Jeff Goldblum's gonna, gonna, gonna be it. the one that defeats the dinosaur. With a flaming oh, yeah. locust on a fucking spear that he pulled out of his ass, like three hundred, he was like, "Oh yeah, yeah, yeah." Oh, yeah, that was cool. <laughs> they lit those locusts on fucking fire. That was a really cool oh yeah, scene. that was cool. That was cool. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it was kind of weird. Like this cool. movie had like a lot of like biblical elements. Like it had like the locusts, like the, the raining fire. Messages. Yeah, yeah I was like, was what a lot the of fuck? Subs in here. But uh, yeah, yeah, man, this movie is like <laughs> it's bonkers. It's insane. It feels like a movie that like was conceived like at a fucking like massive like fucking coke party and people were like oh what yeah and, and then the, the fucking tri- the dinosaurs they team up and they kill the other fuck yeah bro and then they're fucking bro. locusts the oh, fuck, oh hey, yeah oh, black lesbian pilot they're like yeah. they're like yes black <laughs> lesbian like, pilot we gotta add that one in there too but yeah you know, but they did it real subtle perfect. like they did it real subtle like they, they, they were like, uh, at first, they were like talking about something, right? And she was like, oh, I like redheads too. And then, like, at the end, they like show her talking to like her, right? Like, they show her like talking to like a redhead, yeah. right? Or something. Yeah. She's yeah. like on the plane. She's like, so we uh, ran past the dinosaur. And then, she's like, like, what a scissor I'm later. <laughs> she's like, what, what a scissor later. <laughs> I loved her character, though. She was dope, man. I did not yeah. mind that she was in the movie. She's one of the few characters in the movie that I like, besides uh, yeah. Jeff Joel Bloom and, uh, I didn't really care for the girl. I didn't care for Chris Pratt's character. I hated I Chris Pratt. He was just like an annoyance to me. Like every time he came out, I was just like, get out of here, Chris Pratt. Go go back to space. Get the fuck out of here. What the <laughs> fuck? Go back to space. <laughs> like, what the fuck, dude? Get out of here, bro. Yeah, man. Go, Chris go be Pratt. Mario. I don't watch you in this movie. Oh, man. That's probably coming out pretty soon. Dude. <laughs> oh, Shit. God. Yeah, man. This is yeah, Jurassic World, man. Um, did you do you watch the one before this, right? Did you a little bit of it? Yeah. Is, which, did you see all of it? Yo, you didn't see all of it. I was about to ask you. Like, I just I got the general, better? I got the general plot of it. Like it was like volcano erupting, there's poachers, dinosaurs, mm-hmm. Bryce Dallas Howard is running away from a T-Rex in high heels. Let's do it. And that's it. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't know it. which one it. is better. I gotta rewatch the last one. And um, see if really put it together. If I had to pick, if I had to pick a better one, mm-hmm. I would pick the one before this one. Yeah, the first. Oh, the second. The second one. The second the one, one is better than this third one. Yeah, mm-hmm. the second one okay. has the second one has like less stuff going on, and it's more like just this, this, and this is happening. Let's go. This one is like this, yeah, yeah. and the the, the the clone, and the, yeah, this the, was, the family. This was, almost, this was almost like a secret spy movie. This is like a stupid like, movie. They're flying <laughs> in different locations. They're fucking investigating. Yeah, what was up with that, it, dude? The first like, fucking 30 minutes of the movie, they were like, uh, fucking Morocco, the, the fucking Antarctic, the fucking uh, over here and over there. <laughs> they, they kept going to like, I was like, can y'all stop going places? I was like, can I just pick one fucking place for the movie and do that? I was like, what the fuck? Yeah. I was like, is this a commercial for fucking Expedia or something or Travelocity? What the fuck is this shit? Dot com. Yeah. <laughs> I thought Idris Elba was going to yeah. come out and be like, booking. We're booking.com. You could go to all these places you just saw right now. <laughs> like, what the fuck? 
Yeah, this shit was crazy. It was a. Uh, I like the. I did like the dinosaurs though. They did look fire as fuck. Most of them, like yeah. the big action scenes and stuff. Like when the dinosaurs are good. were doing their thing, they did for the most part look good when they were doing their thing. You know what I'm saying? I was like, damn, it's been a minute since I saw some dinosaur velociraptors some running dino action, motherfuckers through the goddamn jungles and shit. That was dope, man. All the you know where you are. You're in the jungle, baby. <laughs> You're going <laughs> down. And then locusts come out and eat everybody. <laughs> there it is, yeah. Fucking locusts. Those bastard Jurassic locusts. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this movie was definitely Jurassic, all right. It was ass. <laughs> it was ass. Yeah, man. So mm. what are you thinking about rating uh, Jurassic World Domino's Pizza? Man, Jurassic World Domino's Pizza, man. I don't... I feel like if you... I don't know, man. I feel like this is... I mean, it's no Top Gun, you know what I'm saying? Oh, uh, Top Gun Maverick is just the good movie. Go watch Top uh, Gun know, Maverick. That's what I'm saying. Like, that shit is crazy. Like, that shit is crazy. But, like, this right here, this is, uh, this is like, you know, the last, the, the, the watery refill of Jurassic World. Yeah, like, this is like, like the backwash that is, like, the fucking uh, Jurassic World a franchise at this point. At This point, this is the last hurrah right here. You get, <laughs> this is the last gulp of Jurassic franchise that you guys are going to get right here. For You're not going to see this for a long time. For, for a little bit. Like maybe maybe four years. Well, I mean, if you are, like, Jeff Goldblum's not coming back. The original oh, no, cast yeah. is not coming back. They're going to be way too old. You know what I'm saying? Like, majority of these cast members <laughs> are not. You're not going to. This is the last time you're going to see your beloved franchise. They're damn near like, fossils at this point. These motherfuckers are almost as old as the fucking yo, dinosaurs what's in the movie. Name? What's their name, bro? We were talking about it earlier today, bro. Laura that- Dern? Laura Dern. It's crazy wow. to me that Laura Dern is a uh, way younger than like Sam Neill and uh, Jeff Goldblum. Yeah, yeah like yeah. she does not. It does not seem that Ooh. way. <laughs> yeah, that's just wild. That shit was wild, man. But um, all right. So Jurassic World Dominoes. What am I gonna give it? Um, I'm gonna give give it a. I'm, I gotta go with like the two point five, man. I give it a two point five. Whoa, you out know? of ten. Oh yeah, out of ten. Oh yeah, my bad. Sorry. Out of ten, I gotta give it a. I'll give it a five. I'll get a. Uh, wait, five. That's a little tough. Uh, out of ten, I'll give it a six point. Uh, six point. Uh, six. I'll give it a six point five. Out of ten, it's the. Uh, it's not. It's not good. It's not that great, but it's entertaining. I couldn't look away, and it's yeah. a fucking dinosaur movie, so I really didn't expect much from it. So yeah, I'm gonna give it a six point five out of ten. You know what I'm saying? It's definitely worth watching. Um, if you part, if you like Jurassic World, this is a lot of fan fucking uh, fan. Uh, oh yeah, this is a lot of like dick stroking of like the fucking Jurassic Park fucking fandom. They're like, oh, oh they're like, you like fucking Jeff Goldblum? Oh, you like the fucking in Barbasol the- <laughs> yeah. in your face? You like the original <laughs> theme? Let's put that in here. <laughs> Like we're gonna plug all the fields for you. We're gonna throw some scenes in here that are gonna remind you of the same other scenes. Mm-hmm. Like this is definitely it's it's not the Top Gun of reboots, but it's definitely a decent reboot. So I'll I'll give yeah. it a six point five. It's a Hollywood cash out reboot. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, a summer summer blockbuster movie, a dinosaur movie. I can't expect much from it. So that's why I'm gonna I'll, I'll give it a six point five, man. I'm gonna give this bad. movie. Uh, I'm gonna give this movie a. Four out of ten. I re- I really didn't like this. I don't like. I don't like uh, to begin with. I don't like uh, Jurassic Park. But I mean, I can I can I can respect the I can respect like the first Jurassic Park and stuff. And it's mm-hmm. all like leagues above this movie. The first Jurassic Park is like fifty seven thousand times better like than this movie. Like even I can admit that. And yeah. uh, oh, but sure. yeah, this film was like overstuffed badly acted everybody in this film kind of just seemed like they just showed up on set and were like oh what okay uh, all right uh, we're almost done with this right and uh mm-hmm. it's just stuffed to the gills with uh with actors too many main characters too many fucking plot threads that go kind of like nowhere at the end of the movie mm-hmm. it's uh cheesy as all fucking hell uh there's not enough fucking dinosaurs in the dinosaur movie i've never seen a jurassic park movie that. where the dinosaurs like take a back seat to like this fucking stupid ass like human element which shouldn't even be a part of like the fucking these kinds of movies like we come to mm-hmm. see the fucking cgi dinosaurs just give us the fucking cgi dinosaurs 
Uh, but yeah, man. But I will say that I did enjoy whenever the movie like shows cool shit, like the dinosaurs, like actually shows you the dinosaurs and them doing cool dinosaur shit. Yo, the the, thing, the, the scene good. the scene where she uh, went under the water, like when she was slowly walking under the water, yeah, the swamp and shit. That scene was dope as fuck. You know what I'm saying? There was some cool visuals, but my yeah, there was cool stuff. Yeah, that was cool and stuff, but, but it like, was, there wasn't enough though. It wasn't. It enough. was cool, but then I was just kind of like, why didn't the thing kill her? Like he like basically pecked her on the fucking head and just like left. I was like, what the fuck? But yeah, the movie has like absurd, crazy, crazy person logic, and even though it's like yeah, a crazy movie, there's no logic. Yeah, it's just like everything is fucking bonkers, insane, mm-hmm. and I was just kind of like, wow, what is this? But yeah, four out of ten. Uh, just go see Top Gun Maverick. <laughs> just go see Top Gun Maverick. <laughs> uh, the, I mean, there, definitely... you, there you have it, ghouls and gals. Uh, we journey through the world that is Jurassic. We uh, talked to Chris Pratt. We talked to Blue. We did it all just for you. And once again, I'm Ryan T. And this man right here, he's... Sid Retro 727, man. Thank you guys for tuning in for another episode, man. Yo, oh, yeah. go ahead and uh, yo, check it out or not, man. <laughs> yeah. Let us know what's going on. If you're yeah. going to go check it out, let us know. If you're not going to check checked it, out, it out, based on this review, let us know. It's yeah. going to... I, would I watch it again? No, I'm not going to no, watch it. I wouldn't watch Dredge. I, I wouldn't, wouldn't watch, watch this again, again either. No, no hell But no. to complete the franchise and stuff, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Go ahead. <laughs> All right. All right, ghouls and gals. We'll see you in the next one.